Well, a police officer in China has set out on a personal crusade to save the capital city's dog population. A recent crackdown on oversized and unregistered dogs has provoked panic among Beijing's pet owners. But one policeman continues to bend the rules, rescuing dozens of pooches from the clutches of his colleagues. He's known as Beijing's greatest dog lover. During a crackdown on oversized and unregistered canines, policeman Xiao He has been rescuing animals captured by his colleagues. He raises them in a small guardhouse office to save them from their fate. They are certainly all euthanized because there are so many dogs captured each day. I met a guy in charge of the dog collection, and he said they seized about 200 dogs a day. The stepped-up campaign has triggered panic among dog owners. Many only walk their pets late at night or early in the morning when police are unlikely to be on patrol. Authorities say the campaign is aimed at ridding the city of dangerous breeds, including those over 35 centimetres high. Some big dogs are docile and some small dogs can bite people. So this policy really doesn't make sense. Pet ownership has ballooned across China. Beijing is now home to one million registered pooches. With it, a growing animal rights movement, calling for a new law against animal cruelty. We simply don't know how the dogs end up. They may be sold to extract oil for facial creams or fed to the tigers in the zoo or killed with toxic gas or sold for furs. We simply don't know. Liu says lawful dog owners deserve more transparency, especially as they're required to pay annual fees to register their pets. I asked the government to revise the dog regulations. Did you hear back from them? No, I haven't. Police haven't announced how many animals have been seized in this year's campaign. Some activists say it's bigger than previous years and they're willing to fight for every dog's life.